since we have less LEDs than the maximum amount of LEDs that can be connected to uh, the controller port I'm going to connect this layout to the port 1 of the controller ok select the worksheet and zoom it zoom near to the first LED alright and select the multi-line text and click anywhere next to the first LED click here alright and type 0 in your keyboard and press enter and here you go and I'm going to change the size of the letter to 1 which means 1 inch alright ok now I'm going to type P1 because we are going to connect this layout to the port 1 we have created our port label and click OK here we go here's our port label if you want to edit it double click on it in order to connect the port label with the LED layout select the line tool and click on the first LED center and select on the port label you have created here you go and press center to finish the connection alright think of situation like this uh, you have reached the maximum amount of LEDs that can be connected to, to the port one exceeds and now you have to connect the, the LEDs to the port 2 to do that I'm going to select the same tool the multi-line text tool sorry right, multi-line text tool ok click next to the first LED of that port alright and press 0 and press enter and to I'm going to change the size to 1 and and I'm going to type P2 alright which means port 2 alright click OK and select the line tool now we are going to create the label P2 label to the first LED of that port click on the center of that first LED of that port and click on the label and press enter to finish you can connect it to any amount of ports like this do a final inspection on the layout and the wiring and if there is any mistakes uh, you can correct it as I said before alright everything is ok now it's time to save it I'm going to file and I'm going to select save as I'm going to save the project first I'm going to give P4 give P5 alright so this is the project file select AutoCAD 2007 drawing click on save now go back to file and select save as and type the file name this is our layout 001 I'm going to select the file type as uh, AutoCAD 2007 DXF file type alright uh, this is the file we are going to import in the LED edit in the next step alright file save now we have saved our 
layout file. Now it's time to close the AutoCAD. Okay, now it's time to import the LED layout to the LED edit software. Double click on LED edit software. I'm going to use uh, LED edit K version 2017. And select new. And select your controller. I'm going to use select the maximum number of lights, LEDs, per port. I'm going to use I will talk about the uh, how to use LED edit software in a later uh, tutorial. And now we have created our project. Select this small button import DXF browse and select the file layout you just created All right, select the layout 001 and select open All right make sure you have selected the impressive connection and I'm going to scale change the scale value to 5 and click OK all right we have the successful message number of successful import lights uh, for an f fan click ok now you will see your led layout here we go as you can see port 1 451 leds all right uh, now let's look into a situation that we have Failed connections. Select DXF, import DXF, and select the layout. I'm going to select completely accurate so we can get more accurate, which will also increase the amount of failed connections. Number of successful import lights 446, and number of unconnected lights 5. We have 5 error connections all right click ok here are the uh, coordinates of that fail connections and just zoom in you can see the blue ones are well connected and the pink ones have the bad connection all right just remember the places that have bad connections as you can see we have two bad connections right here I'm going to cut this, select, uh, go back to your AutoCAD application and open your DXF file. Go to open and select your DXF file. Then zoom in. We have a bad connection here. I'm going to select these two lines and select this point and hold my mouse button. And I'm going to uh, drag it to the center like this. All right, it will snap to the center. We have bad connections here. Select the lines. Select the point. Move it back and click on the worksheet. And select the point again and drag it back to the center all right I'm going to do the same to here select the lines click and hold and drag out and click on the worksheet select the select that point again and drag it into the center of this LED reference. All right. I'm going to save it. I'm going back to the LED edit software. I'm going to import the DXF file we just created. I'm going to select completely accurate and click OK. We now have only two 
bad connections. So I click OK. We we have those bad connections. We have one here, and we have one here. All right, you can fix these bad connections. All right, let's program this layout. All right, select the program tab, select the program, and select the effect tab. And I'm going to select some effect, and you can see how it looks like. All right, as you can see. If you want to zoom it. All right. To stop the video playback, select close video capture. All right. All right. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please subscribe. I will upload more videos in the future. Alright, thank you for watching. I will see you in the next lesson. If you have any problems, please visit my blog post on this tutorial. Link in the description.